only 120 FPS for phone. No, it's only 120 FPS for a specific brand. And the, and the brand, in the brand, it's only one of their phones. It's 120 FPS for one brand, and inside that brand, it's only one of their phones. There's one phone in the entire planet right now optimized perfectly to play this game. Everything else is behind. It's like using old technology. Frag out. It's like playing on an Xbox 360 when the Xbox One's out, dude. You know what I mean? That's what it's like. Like, we have old technology when we're playing, even though... Even though your phone might be, like, brand new or whatever. I hate my life. I'm so, I'm so like angry, man. I can't focus. I don't, I don't want to play, man. I can't, I'm so like, I'm so mad, bro. I'm so mad at what they did, dude. I'm so mad at what they did, bro. I'm so angry. And I'm just like, it's, I'm so sick of it, bro. So annoying. I don't even want to play. I don't want to play this game because I, I'm playing this game that has decided to like, throw away their like hardcore audience you know what i mean just out of a brand deal for a tournament and it's not like they couldn't sponsor the tournament themselves bro they had 300 million downloads in a year they're like oh let's make a one million dollar tournament one million one million not even one million in the final tournament one million in the entire thing dude so 75k for the regional qualifiers and then it's going to be like 500k in the actual tournament. It's not even like a 1 million at the end. It's 1 million overall across the entire planet. You know how small that is? That's tiny. That, like, I know for you guys saying 1 million, that seems like such a huge number. But when you, when you get the 1 million, say the, say the team that wins, say the team that wins gets like 400k, right? Say if Tribe wins, Tribe gets 400k. They have eight players on their roster. That 400k gets divided by eight. That's 50k. I don't know what way their contracts are set up, but let's set up. They've got. Let's say they've got like a 90-10 a split over their, over their um, like their tournament winnings. So they keep 90% and they give Tribe 10%. I don't actually know. This is just speculation. Um, that's like what? Well, how much is that gone as well? Is that not like another 5k gone? Wait, no. Because they're only getting... Wait, how much are they getting? 400k. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's like a, that's a 5k if they're getting 10%. So they're only getting 45k. And then depending on where you are in the world, if you're in like a certain area, that puts you into the highest tax bracket, being over 40k. And when you're in the highest tax, tax bracket, depending on where you are, that's 40% to 52% taxed. So that's half of that money gone, which puts you down to 20... Like what? 27.5 grand? Out of a million dollar turn you're gonna get 27 grand you're gonna get twenty seven thousand dollars for winning a tournament that is advertised as a million dollar tournament that's sponsored by a phone that's perfectly optimized for this game while leaving everyone else and the mass community of the game in the past you think that's do you think that's a smart business decision in the long play when you have a, a sphere of people playing on completely different devices than the one that you only optimized for that's ridiculous that is absurd that is that is just the behavior behind the deal of whatever they orchestrated is just disrespectful to the entire community and i'm very 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 unhappy about it very unhappy about it and if i don't say something about it then nobody else will like i said everyone else took a deal with that phone that's exactly like that's exactly why i didn't want to touch that phone dude What is he talking about? I'm talking about the fact that the game is optimized for one device, which is the device that they chose to run and sponsor through champs. The championship is sponsored by Sony Xperia Mark II, and it's the only phone in the world that has got the game optimized currently. And it wasn't even affecting me in there. Multiplayer is okay, but BR, it is dead. It, it like the fps drops down when you're driving the driving the little vehicles around it it feels like you're playing in beta it's terrible i really do, i'm really angry i'm super angry i never chat when when have i complained like when have i actually been angry over cod mobile in the past like let's say in the past like two months you know what i mean the only time i ever raise my voice at something is when it's dumbass stuff like the s36 being able to laser beam people across the map Back in season three, I told them about that. I said that this was completely skillless and that it needed to be nerfed. It got nerfed. 
And then I said about the freaking desync. The desync issues in that one season. When was that? Was that season eight? And it was terrible, dude. And I was like spamming them, telling them that this like needed fixed ASAP. And they fixed that. When the RC RC car gravity spike issue was around, and that's all anyone was doing in ranked was spamming RC grav spikes. I said about that. But dude, this is like this is a this is this issue is a complex issue above my pay grade. Like it's not me that can like even show them the community's reaction and bring it towards them because they've already taken this deal like it's already been signed you know what i mean they've basically signed away the soul of the game towards this company until this sponsorship ends <clears throat> the bundle i don't care did if you want did the bundle issue is a separate issue see all the stuff where people complain about like buying stuff Sh shut up dude the main issues are not with skins the main issues are with how the game is played if you don't have the money for skins, just don't buy them. Just don't buy the skins. They give you countless free skins every single month. We get three free character skins a month. We get a free battle pass bunch of skins every single month, dude. And then if you want to buy the premium battle pass, you get a bunch of free skins, or not free skins, a bunch of easily acquired skins as well. The skins are not the issues. The bundles are not the issues. The lucky draw, it's just not the issue. The real issue is down to the core gameplay, which is what the majority of people play it play and what the majority of people care about and having a device that is perfectly optimized ahead of the competition when comparing it to every other device and making it unfair because you've sponsored and signed a deal signed away your soul of your game to this company is an l and that's just the way it has to be